Andy Allen here again for Applied Shoulder Can. I have a nice heavy bag drill here for you. It's a, a kind of a lengthy one. It's about eight or nine combinations. I'll, I'll, I'll break it down for you. And if you like this and would like to do a workout at home, I will soon be doing a video uh, in the form of a HIIT workout. H-I-I-T, High Intensity Interval Training. And I will link that here. And I will also link it with the icon at the end of the video. So the, the drill we're going to work on in air, the key on looks like this. So we start with Nagashizuki. So Nagashizuki is flowing punch. It, this might be new to you. It kind of feels like you're going forward with Kazamazuki, but imagine instead of coming straight in that line of fire, I'm going to shift off the side, flowing punch, All right? It, it still should have a forward feeling, not like escaping to the side and retreating. It's still forward. So we've got one, and then from there, we've got a, a, a closed line. I guess you could call that a Mawashi Uriuchi. All right, from there, and kind of swing that in a down, up to down kind of trajectory, get over the shoulder. From there, we're going to shift our front foot away from the bag or the bob. We're going to throw a back leg roundhouse kick, step back as the bag swings forward. We're going to throw overhand right, crash in, elbow, elbow, grab the head and the shoulder. Here's where a bob would be better than a bag. Shuffle step, knee off the side, index with the right hand. So a left Yakuzuki and a right hook to finish. <coughs> Start off with a Nagashizuki. We have one, two, and remember when you do this, you don't want to hit with a straight elbow, otherwise you're gonna hyperextend that joint and you're gonna be laid up for a while. What I like to do is start with it straight and then just before impact, I kind of whip it around like that for some extra velocity. Start straight and then come finish it with it bent, okay? So we have one, two, I'm really close to my roundhouse kick here. I'm gonna kick with this leg. I'm gonna take my front leg, I'm gonna shift it away. As I do that, you notice my body turns. I'm gonna use that rotation to deliver the roundhouse kick. And then at impact, I step back. That's gonna make the bag swing forward, uh, back once you hit with some, some impact. As it comes back, you're gonna come in with an overhand right, crash in clinch, elbow, elbow grab that imaginary head and the shoulder that's where a bob's going to be better suited than a heavy bag do a little shuffle step for a, a knee come off the side yakuzuki hook punch to finish okay kind of nice and slow here looks something like this one two shift off three come back and we'll hand we hand right crash and clinch elbow elbow shuffle step index yakuzuki hook you can throw a jodan or a shovel hook down low if you want. All right, let's try it a couple more times. icon right there if so that means the hit workout's ready come on 10 minutes you have time give it a go if you're looking for some more heavy bag drills i have one right here you might like give that a try until next time i'm andy l for pleasure to can keep training